And I'm sure that in the course of time, we will understand what he's doing. And when these results of his actions and activities begin to manifest, Nigerians will know that he has come prepared and committed to rescue Nigeria and take us to a part of glory. So to that extent, I'm very proud of my visit. And I must confess, he is just a very humble president. Thank you. Given from the perspective of environmental concerns, it was totally impossible for Mr. President that we know for his high level of integrity and morality to come and uh, do the groundbreaking if the project has such characteristics. There had no link, it had no connectivity with politics, it had no connectivity with the issues concerning uh, funding or whatever. It was basically a technical issue that needed to be resolved. And it has been resolved and I'm happy to announce that. With the discussion I had with Mr. President this morning, it is obvious that very soon a new date will be communicated. But I must add that the superhighway, which is the proposed road transitioning from Calabar and evacuating people to the Casinala Road, which is the right route from Calabar to northern Nigeria, is expected to create a hybrid between northern and southern Nigeria. The emphasis is that it creates completely brand new opportunities for investment, and new cities will spring along the superhighway.